I'm Steve Mould. I'm Matt Parker. And this is Mass Gear, where we sell nerdy mass things. And now, nerdy playing cards. So, Steve, I'm going to show you a magic trick using okay. a pack of cards. So, if you want to open right, that there. Open this. So, uh, they are sold uh, in an almost impenetrable plastic uh, force shield like layer. It, it comes, it's an easy open tab. But, it's really uh, easy it's... open tab. Only the tab is easy open, the rest of the packet is not. Uh, so, while Steve is. <laughs> Showing how none of our products contain any choking hazards. <laughs> I am going to uh, run you through the way this uh, trick works. Oh, do you want to get them out and just give them a shuffle? Okay. So I've got some standard playing cards. They, we don't sell these. These are the normal uh, cards you'd buy uh, in any shop, not ours. And one of the crazy things about cards is they're meant to, on the backs, all be identical. So the back of every single card should be the same, so you, you can't tell which is which. And on the front, they're genuinely very uh, symmetric. Well, they're generally very symmetric. So these playing cards are uh, general, generally they're quite symmetric, right? But not all of them. So the six, you can see because of the way that the pips on the six of spades are up, you can tell if it's that way or if it's that's different. Oh, yeah. So uh, we've got uh, two facing upwards here. But here we've got four yeah. facing upwards. So to most people, that looks identical to that. But if yeah. you know what you're looking for, you can tell that actually it's different. Mm. Uh, that is perfectly symmetric, perfectly symmetric, symmetric, not symmetric, not symmetric. Because there's one centre one. Whenever there's a centre pip, you can tell which way up the card is by which way that pip is facing. So if you take those out and give them a shuffle. Okay, so Steve's going to show off a quick riffle shuffle. Oh, that was great. Good work, good work. All that right, so. Level. Okay, so I'll put these away. Now what you want to do is pick a card at random. Yeah. And have a look at it. Don't show me. And my prediction is, Steve, that your card is one of the symmetric ones. Yes! It is! There you are, look at that. It's perfectly Seven symmetric. of diamonds. Seven of diamonds. Completely symmetric. Do you want to try again? Try again. Yeah, ready okay. this time? Ready? Ready? Okay, yeah. Have a look at it. See if it's symmetric or not. Yeah. I'm going to read your mind. It is symmetric. Yes. Oh, there you go. Oh my god. There was the jack. jack. Oh, I'm yeah. spades in this occasion. And this trick, I can do this for as long as you want. Every time Steve takes a card out, I'll be able to tell if it's symmetric or not. Yeah. Uh, symmetric? No. Really? No, it's, uh, it's, it's a, a, uh, yeah. you. Uh, And the way the trick works is all of the cards are symmetric. It's a force deck. It's a force deck. You're forced <laughs> to take a symmetric card. Okay. But it has every it has every possible card. Yeah, they haven't just taken out the ones that okay. aren't symmetric. So actually, so we do. Oh, these are nice. Look at the uh, so so symmetrical letters. Oh, okay. oh my god, I love doing. It. So if you have a look at all the cards in the, you can't. Oh, see them. The card, that was a waste. Of, okay, you have a look at all the okay. cards. Look at those. They are. This is, so oh, this not is only the nine is lovely. So there's a sort of the middle pip is. Like, yeah, so they've cheated. So they've doubled up the middle pip on the nine to make the heart symmetric and a, a fantastic magician, a guy called Jordan Gold, uh, designed these with his brother who is a graphic designer and they went through and made every single card in the deck perfectly symmetric and so not only are they lovely lovely cards and because he is a professional magician they're really nice cards, they slide really well, they're, they're nice and resist they're so good. It's the, same it, it, uh, it's the same manufacturing as um, bicycle decks. Yeah, so, so they're, they're the same as bike cards, but uh, symmetric each way. And there are some magic tricks you can do where you get someone to take a card and then you rotate the deck and get them to put it back in again. And if you make sure they take it from the section of the deck where you've put all the asymmetric cards, you can tell which one they picked by ah. looking at which way I go. This means you can no longer do that trick. <laughs> so, so, so it's good if for you that. do that trick, don't buy this deck, is what I'm trying to say. But from a mathematical point of view, a perfectly rotation, look at that, you yeah. can rotate them and they're the same. So I've got a, uh, a game. Oh, okay. Right. So well. I started with a fantastic magic trick that you can do only with the perfectly symmetric uh, pack of cards from maskgear.co.uk. Let's see if you can finish with, with a trick. Uh, no, it's a game. So okay. this is uh, yeah, this is a game. It's a uh, solitaire game, so you play it on your own. It's called 52 Card Pickup. I'm not for... You go pick those up. You're such a jerk. <laughs> 